Downhole motors are commonly known as mud motors because they're driven by the circulation of the drilling mud. There are two basic types of mud motors, positive displacement motors and turbine motors. The positive displacement motor, or PDM, is easily the most versatile tool for building or maintaining hole angle. It enables us to initiate deflection simply by incorporating a bent housing into the motor or by using a bent sub or eccentric stabilizer. The bent housing shown here is adjustable, thus providing even greater flexibility and directional control. Conversely, to keep a straight well course in crooked hole formations, we can run the motor without a bent housing or bent sub. The heart of the positive displacement motor is the rotor stator assembly, where circulating fluid imparts torque to the rotor and causes it to turn. A universal connection transfers this rotation through a bearing and drive shaft assembly to a rotating bit sub, which turns the bit. The drill string itself does not rotate. This allows us to orient the bit in the desired direction. Positive displacement motors provide excellent steerability for deflecting or straightening the well course. In addition, they allow us to increase the bit RPM without increasing the drill string rotation and to drill with less weight on bit. This can result in higher penetration rates compared to drilling with a rotating Kelly and reduced drill pipe and casing wear, an important consideration especially when drilling high angle holes. Positive displacement motors are available in a wide variety of sizes, rotating speeds and output characteristics for a broad range of downhole conditions. A turbine motor consists of multiple rotor stator assemblies that drive main thrust bearing sections. These tend to have narrower operating ranges than positive displacement motors, and unlike PDMs, they can't accommodate bent housings. Still, they've seen wide use in the former Soviet Union where they've undergone their most extensive development, as well as in other parts of Europe and in the North Sea.